My name is John. We're at Jane and Machine in Salt Pro Mass. I'm working on Seth Custom Bombs engine, and I've got the uh, boring slash milling machine set up now to resurface Seth's cylinder head that we can see how badly it was warped because he initially asked me, you know, how bad is it? And once I take an initial pass of a couple thousands, we're going to see how you know good or how bad original Model A cylinder head is, or I should say was.
about the ten thousandths now, and it still hasn't cleaned the center, as well as out in the corner here, it's still a shadow of where it was loose. You're gonna take a final pass and that'll yes. be it? Yeah, okay. Final pass. John, what was the last thing we just did? Well basically I changed the changed the cutter because we, we were aggressive in the first few passes because the cylinder head was so wavy. So in order to get it down, naturally I have a different tool bit that I don't you know, need to worry about a good finish. So after we got down so it was more or less flat, the final pass I changed the tool bit to a, a new cutter and you know, took the last two thousandths off. So, in essence, we've taken sixteen thousandths total off of this cylinder head. And you can see, you know, like I was mentioning, the thumb test, you can see my thumb yeah, the reflection yeah, yeah. of the cast iron. Wow. So, and this is the proper finish for, you know, a cast iron uh, copper head gasket because you can still feel a little bit of the, the graininess in it so it can basically keep the gasket from sliding around. It's not too smooth nor it's too coarse. <laughs> 